how to improve uh, English? How you to have some ideas and some tricks? Mm, there are so ma many tricks and tricks to improve our English. Firstly, we have to remove our concept. So, what do you think uh, English is important for our life? Yeah. It depends on the person. When uh, ma'am says that ki when person want to travel in a outside the country, they also know the English language. Because most of people and everywhere, if you go go, uh, go uh, corporate sector, any other country, it's important part to us. Move to another country or uh, want to study abroad, then you have to be proficient in English. So like past tense, present tense, future tense. <coughs> in this case, if you if uh, as you know, my name is Uttappa and uh, I'm a network and security engineer. I stay in Mumbai and uh, basically I'm from Karnataka. I'm here today to learn and enhance my communication skills and boost my you know, confidence. Uh, as we're discussing today, I understand the most important part of our uh, life, the communication as, is language. So we, we all belong and we have so many languages belong to our uh, native. And we are giving a most importance to the English. English is a uh, great or a good language to you know uh, learn or acquire something. Because most of people and everywhere, if you go go, uh, go uh, corporate sector, any other country, it's important part to us. It's becoming a very necessity things to you know uh, learn. It's a very good good thing because uh, people are you people are struggling to uh, you know enhance or uh, acquire this language because. We belong to us a uh, very uh, different language or some, we have uh, like original or uh, native language, religion, everything will be there. And the most import, important uh, thing is that we, we have option to. You have one partner opposite of you and you are going to just ask, raise questions, answer the questions that how to discuss, how to speak and how to make our English effective. Hello, from by. How are you? I'm, I'm fine. What about you? I'm also fantastic. Uh, can you uh, tell me what's your opinion about uh, how to speak English? How to speak English? Yes. First of all, if any person want to... Little louder. Little louder. Please. First of all, if any person want to learn a new language... Yes, yes. First, he will have to do clear his grammar. Grammar. Then he will have to do about listening practice. After, for, if first he will be able to clear his grammar, like past tense, everything, then he will have to intimate, he will have to pretend of the after listening the music, then he will be able to then he will be able to speak English. That is true. Yes, yes. <clears throat> According to you, if you want to speak English, you want to learn language English. So you first of all you speak uh, you read uh, grammar English grammar na no? yes uh, yes so according to uh, uh, I have a question that uh, if you want to money uh, uh, I see on uh, YouTube uh, many teachers uh, tell me uh, many teachers uh, suggest uh, that if you want to uh, learn uh, English language so you don't uh, need any grammar you speak first uh, firstly you speak then you will speak so you will uh, after that after that you will get uh, uh, gain confidence and after that uh, uh, one day you will uh, perfect your uh, will speak english yes sir. if you want to louder 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 if you want to speak english first of all we have to basic like only past tense i am not saying that you have to clear deeply grammar deeply grammar like active verb passive verb first of like past tense present tense future tense in this case, if you, if you got this, these tenses, how to use properly, then you, you will be able to speak English. As we all know, English is a global language and it is spoken by almost 16-17% of the world population. Okay. And uh, if you want to make a good uh, communication in English, then you have to read uh, books. You have to start with the basic books, uh, which yes. is easier to, easier to understanding. And... Uh, so then after you uh, you want to make a better communication so that, that things are the beneficial for the continuous growth of the english communication just communication in every aspect of louder, the louder, life louder. so if you are moved to another country or uh, want to study abroad then you have to be proficient in english then I think uh, you should try and uh, you will achieve after the practice. 
are you excited or nervous yes i am excited so can i ask few questions related yes. to the english yes what do you okay. think about the english it's important or not sometimes it it's important but in india not so much important because our indian language is a hindi so it's important for our personality de- development and skills improvement not for any place and anywhere so what do you think uh, english is important for our life yeah nahi it depend on the person when uh, ma'am says that ki when person want to travel in a outside the country they also know the english language and the person who know the basic knowledge of english they was they live in india so they not much more know, know about the english it's okay on that part if i student want to learn english so what do you think what is the basic requirement for the english if a new by student want to know about you, the english in india we also uh, in india all the student want to get a environment we are here for the environment no matter you are learn tenses no matter you learn grammar you, when you are in a environment of a english then you definitely the one thing uh, no matter you don't know about the tenses know about the grammar when you are uh, in front of art all the person speak in english they then you definitely speak english no matter is the wrong or wrong the most of the student who are facing difficulties because of they are hesitate to uh, speak in front of people because they thought that ki the person who front of us they are judging me they are uh, all all the time they judging you and uh, what we are saying wrong, right or we, what we are saying wrong so, so there is another question i have uh, if you want to categorize the uh, levels in uh, english so how can you categorize the levels just like grammar ya fir vocabs ya sentences actually i just uh, ask you uh, i just say you one thing ki uh, in a foreigner country the the unborn the child who are get bo- bo- born so he has a he has no knowledge about the grammar and they speak very well because of the so i just first categorize the environment then uh, know about the tenses or knowledge you don't uh, think so it's all about genetics hari om good morning arti how are you i am fine what about you i am also good okay uh, the uh, we all speak how to improve our uh, communication how to improve our uh, english speaking okay uh, i have some questions uh, yes first question is uh, what is english and why uh, english is important this is a language and what is your second question so why it is important yeah like in today generations uh, when you are going to um, do a job and when you are going to school so it's uh, affect uh, on you like uh, when you uh, when you are able to speak english you will get a uh, good job and able to um, communicate different different country with different different people it means uh, if i know hindi then i don't survive in uh, yeah, any country can't survive can't survive in in india when you go like uh, every 30 km or 50 km you go you got different language yes. so that's why english is impo- also important in india so how to improve uh, english how to have some ideas and some tricks mm, there are so many tricks and tricks to improve our english firstly we have to remove our consciousness like you can see here uh, so many people over, are over consciousness is there over consciousness okay. are there and they are all under confidence when you see sir earlier told us ki like log utna mouth se nahi darte jitna stress se darte hain so firstly we have to remove our unconsciousness and we have to confident the first step is confident we have to confidence and when